For most people, the uhs and ums really come out when they're in the act of trying to remember, um, oh, what's next? Oh, what do I say next? Where's my speech here? What's in my outline? Oh, I can't quite read the teleprompter or the PowerPoint slides. Don't put so much pressure on your memory when you're giving a presentation. It's simply human nature. If you're feeling a little uncomfortable, and most people feel uncomfortable when they're speaking, giving presentations, talks, even leaving a voicemail, if it's not with a close friend, the uhs and ums come out because you're trying to remember what to say and you're trying to talk at the same time. I want to make life easy for you. Reduce the stress. Here's the tip. I want you to, don't tell anyone, cheat. I want you to actually cheat. This is a technique I use all the time. I have never been caught. By the way, there's nothing unethical about it or illegal. What I'm talking about is when you're giving an important speech, presentation, talk, briefing, or even just having a meeting with someone, use a cheat sheet. Here's a single sheet of paper that I use, and I just have two or three at most four words to remind me of the point. I use large font, typically 20 point or larger. Use bold lettering. This way I don't have to pick it up. It's on a single sheet, so I'm not flipping pages. It's large enough font so I don't have to bend over or stop and kind of fiddle with my glasses. Oh, my, my, my. hang on, let me get my glasses. I don't have to do any of that. It's just very large. I can have it right in front of me. If I'm standing up, it can be on a lectern, on a table. If I'm sitting down, it can be right at the table. This takes all the pressure off. The more relaxed you are, the more you can simply talk to people and not think about, oh, mama, mama, what am I going to say next? I forgot. I'm not, I don't know what I'm going to say. If you're not thinking about remembering and forgetting and what you're going to say, you can just be relaxed and be in the moment. And that's when you'll see the ums and uhs melt away.